Well, you guys remember this XRT Pro here that we uh, replaced the HDMI port on and uh, it wasn't working? Well, I have a tester cable here that's supposed to be working. Let's go test it in my car. I know for a fact the cable is working. So the XRT and the Minimax are exactly the same board, so uh, let's try to compare these. Okay, so the biggest discrepancy I found here is that the ground here is not connected. It's an open line. So now I'm going to try to find out where that connects here and must be a blown fuse or a capacitor or a resistor or something. Strange, I removed the LCD and I test it again and uh, the ground is good. Well, in the car it worked for just a second and then it died. That tells me there's a hairy chip here. I'm going to redo the HDMI port and check some more. As suspected, it's back to open line. It's weird. Move the LCD screen just to make sure, and it's still open line. I'm going to go over the legs here one more time, because that's where it connects to the power on that small resistor. Okay, I ran those through here one more time. The multimeter is reading good right now, so uh, let's go to... No, it's not that at all. It's something more serious. So I put a brand new port on here, and uh, it's the same problem. However, check this out. Oh, you hear that? Oh, you hear that? It's turning on when I put my finger right there. Boom. There has to be something wrong with the capacitors in that area right there. Let's go check it out. I compared the uh, bad board to the working board here, and yes, the cap is bad. So let's go replace All right, I replaced that small cap. And boom, I'll be damned. It's working. Wow, nice. All right, I put it together here with the good screen, and uh, yeah, it's nice. Let's go.